Hey, it's Vaughn, and welcome back to Far Harbor 4, Fallout 4, ladies and gentlemen. In the last episode, we were attempting to find all of Dima's secrets across the island. We found the first one. We have the windmill shutdown key, whatever, to allow the fog to destroy the Far Harbor residents. Legendary super mutant overlord. Well, meet my sniper rifle. You can't even mutate. Sit the fuck down. We have two more secrets to find. We are in a soda factory, of all things. Uh, where we will attempt to find the second one. Looks like it is about 40 meters below us. Let's loot this guy. Didn't say let's right. Let's loot this guy is what I was trying to... Oh. Hi. There. Oh, that's power armor. Never mind. Exterminators, Deathclaw, Gauntlet. Guess what? Can't even take it. Um, unless it's absolutely something that I need to take. I'm not going to take it because we are pretty much at our carry weight. We have a Vim Ambassador Terminal. I'm going to fast forward through these so you guys can read them if you would like to. Not fast forward, but pause the screen. For a split second, you guys can pause the screen if you want. Looks like we got some Vim Power uh, schematics. I think it was... Um, I think it was Power Armor. Um, a paint job for the Power Armor, right? Okay. I mean, there's a reason there's power armor sitting right behind us we can go ahead and take a look at that uh that paint job i would imagine yes you've got vim i think this is something new they've constructed i've never heard of vim in the entirety of the fallout universe before uh we're gonna take the fusion core and we're gonna leave everything else because i've got more than enough power armor nor do i use it ever Okay, there's some shooting in the distance, which is kind of odd, considering usually when there are super mutants. Actually, what do we have over here? What is that thing? A mole rat. Okay, so it looks like they're actually fighting a mole rat, or two, or three, or four, or five, or any other combination of numbers. Kind of want to just jump over the edge. You know what I just realized? Is there actually Vim Soda in this entire location? Did they create a new type of soda? Well, that answers that question. Yes. I was going to say, it would be pretty disheartening if they made an entirely new soda factory and uh, didn't even create some new soda textures. Okay, what is going on in... Are you taking a bath? Is this guy really taking a bath in here or did he just fall in there? What in the world? Oh, hi there. Nick Valentine, you're just going to stand and watch as this guy chases me. Thank you, Nick Valentine. Your damage is laughable, but I appreciate it. And, and, get quick scoped. Okay. Oh, I just realized that wasn't even a, a mole rat. That was a mutant hound, and that makes a lot more sense. Okay, so this thing is right over here. We'll let Nick Valentine take care of uh, all of the super mutants. Hopefully, I didn't just trap myself. I did not. We are in caution. Here we have a terminal with a novice password. No problem. Is it sleep? Is it Daisy? Well, I have a feeling it's flesh. Man. Hey, look at that. Okay, let's open those doors. I did see this uh, first aid pack behind me. And in here we have an elevator. We'll uh, let our companion Nick die. Just kidding. He can't. Because this is a modernized Fallout game, meaning companions cannot die. I guess they can in survival mode, right? Not really sure. Haven't played survival mode, and I won't be playing survival mode. Not my idea of fun. Not at all. Don't mind if I do. Never mind, I do, because I don't want any drugs, but I will take those, even though they're useless. KYE 1.1? Well, that's interesting. Before we do that, though... Let's dig up Dima's second, uh, second secret. My brain combined it there for a second. Okay, we have a hollow tape. What's done is done. Is it, is it going to be painful? Yes. It's going to be like having everything you are ripped out and replaced with something else. Someone else. I'm ready. I just... I wish I could say goodbye to everyone. No one else can know. This isn't just about infiltrating Far Harbor. It's about becoming the human that synths drawn here need to meet. Reasonable. Willing to accept them as just another living thing. No greater or lesser than humanity itself. You'll be part of the bridge between our two worlds. That all vanishes the moment anyone discovers that it's been manufactured. 
that you're a sin. Did she have to die? The, the woman I'm replacing? God, she looks so peaceful lying there. Don't. Please. That blood is on my hands, not yours. Damn it, Dima. I wanted to like you so much. I really, really, really was under the impression you didn't do anything evil. Little did I know you murdered an actual person and replaced her with a synth. Something that we've heard about happening all the time in our uh, main quest playthrough of Fallout 4. But you didn't actually see it happen too often, right? People were always scared that they were being replaced or their family members were replaced with synths. But that, doesn't, that didn't actually happen too often. You know, synths were a threat, but not in that way. And little little do we know, we come here and we find out that, yeah, Avery was actually a synth. We haven't talked to Avery too much, but now that now that we know that she is actually a synth, that changes things significantly. Wow, I'm actually surprised, man. Usually you don't come to uh, that interesting of a plot twist in video games. I mean, you can usually see him coming, at least I can. And this one actually caught me completely by surprise, so well done, Bethesda. Well done. Uh, we'll talk to this guy over here. Rescanning. User isn't approved to enter the medical containment area. Can't say I mind the company, though. It's been a while. I don't think any approved user is going to show up. You can either let me in, or you can keep waiting for eternity. Your choice. Hmm. You actually make a really good point. Very well. There you are. Now, if you'll excuse me, my power capacity is a bit low, so I'm going to go into reserves. Best of luck to you. Well, damn. I wish I had talked to you more. I didn't realize you were just going to shut off. Achievement unlocked. Mercenary. Complete 50 miscellaneous objectives. That's actually a main uh, game achievement. Not related to Far Harbor, if I remember right. Okay. So, what is in the medical area? That was a pretty easy speech check to pass. Medical liquid nitrogen dispenser. I don't think that's unique. Bone cutter. Definitely not. We have a chest here. Ooh, that is quite a lot of ammo. And December's Child, a unique weapon. Lighter and uses 5.56 ammo, 25% faster fire rate, 15% faster reload. So is this a shotgun? Is that why you're telling me that it uses 5.56 when it already looks like an assault rifle? Please don't put me above my carry limit, and it hasn't. Well, let's see what this is. Inventory, weapons, December's Child. Really cool name. Um, I'm going to assume this is a shotgun. Okay, let's put it where my Lefusi Terrabils was. And let's see. No, it seems to be an assault rifle. Okay. Um, I think that's an older... It has a sight on it, and that's interesting, right? This, yeah, this, I'm pretty sure this is an older, uh, gun. I, I feel like I've used this gun in Call of Duty Black Ops, the original. I could be wrong. I don't know much about guns, but, uh, all right. So what we will do is we'll go back and we'll put this where our overseer's guardian was, our resident assault rifle, and we'll put Lefusie de la Bulle back right here. Okay, and that's probably going to be it for the medical lab. I would imagine not much else is going to be here other than a unique freaking weapon that obviously they've put a lot of work into. That's not sarcasm. I mean, literally, this thing has a sight and... Oh, it could just be a mod. I, I don't mod in this game and I don't build things. So anytime I talk about that sort of stuff, keep in mind I have no idea what I'm talking about. I would much rather just... You just... Okay, Nick, if you could... Uh... Yeah, uh, go ahead and just chill down here, I guess. Um, I'd much rather just collect unique weapons, and I- Yes, I'm aware you can mod unique weapons. I haven't modded once this entire game other than for achievements, and I've been totally fine on normal difficulty. And I always play games on normal difficulty, unless there are, uh, achievements related to a higher difficulty. So, that's just the way I play games. No one needs to, uh, go crazy about it. Alright, let's shoot this guy in the back of the head. How, how did that miss? How did that miss? We must have shot the cloth, and thus it went through the cloth when I was thinking that uh, we were shooting an actual piece of his body. That one should have missed, I'm fully aware. Okay, so it looks like all we need to do is go back the way that we came, and we have one more secret to find, so I think I'll just meet you guys when we get out of here. 
Okay, guys, so as I was continuing in the Vim factory, uh, trying to get to the exit, I found a pump regulator, and it's unique. So we're going to take that. We're going to take the ammo out of that. Uh, and also, there's some bowling pins here. Interesting, right? That wasn't anything back there, right? No, it wasn't. Uh, there was a Primus, a Super Mutant Anatomy, and also, right here, a Vim mixing terminal. I'm not sure what we could use this pump regulator for. I would imagine... Obviously, it's something to do with this facility, but I don't know if it's, uh, really? So, we've got two more, so we have to exit and redo this. Um, I don't know if it's related to a quest or just something you have to figure out on yourself. By yourself, I should say. But, uh, let's see if this terminal has any nice. offers in terms of information. Tour notes number six. You guys can pause the screen and read that if you would like to. What is this place? Same thing goes for that. Why are we doing this? I don't know. I'm getting out of here. That's absolutely wonderful and totally up to you. And finally, a security door control. I happen to know where that door is. Right behind us. Valentine like that? Wonderful. I've already completed uh, Valentine's quest, by the way. And have been given his perk and all that sort of stuff. So, some ammo, and not much else. Decent, actually, for a security door. So, I think we'll just take that pump regulator. We can always come back if we uh, really want to. And I will exit this facility. Door should be right over here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are very close to our final objective, and it looks like we've got a whole bunch of super mutants. Now, we could just sneak past. That's what I'd like to do. Looks like we have to go into another uh, location. Another location with super mutants. Like, come on now. Not sure where Nick is. He's somewhere. There he is. Okay, so if Nick could be very, very quiet, eh, we might as well want to take out all these guys, right? Getting hungry. Okay. Are you hungry for bullets? Because, uh, guess what? That's what you're going to get. All right. Let's uh, fire one shot at that, and then we'll try and kill the super mutant overlord. Did that work? That did indeed work. We should have probably fired at the overlord first, but it shouldn't be uh, too big of a deal. As I say that, I just realized we missed out on our... Uh... Okay. Well, time to switch over to our new weapon, December's Child, and see how good this one is. Oh, my God. Wow, that guy's taking no damage and dealing a ton. Okay, let's get some cover. This guy's firing with such, like, a an indifference. He's just standing in place. Come on, December's child. Is that all the damage that you can do? It feels like that's not much. Then again, that is an, an overboard. But even on the glowing mutant hound, yeah. Okay, whereas... Oh my god, there are... Oh my god! There are so many super mutants here. We're going to go in a sneak. We're going to go into the Harbor Brand Hotel. And once again, Nick is going to die. Just kidding. He can't die. But bad things are going to happen to Nick, basically. Now, we are going to press B. We are going to go into inventory. Into miscellaneous. We are going to... No, so, wait. A. Sorry. We're going to use a stealth boy. Best Left Forgotten has been completed, interestingly enough, because we have not found the last secret, although it's close. What is that noise? I will. I am definitely going to stay hidden because, my god, there are so many of you. I mean, I could definitely kill all of you, but not, not all at once. Not all at once, even though I'm level uh, 50, whatever it is. Okay, um... Well, looks like we need to kill this mutant hound at least. I can't even tell if my weapon is out. Okay, no, go to the mutant hound. Go to the head. Please die. There we go. Off it comes. Easy peasy. Uh, how are we going to make it? Okay, they still don't see me. If we remain... <laughs> Look at our... Oh, God. All right, going to go into our inventory. Going to press one more stealth boy. Jesus Christ. I... We can't even move. Unless they all come in here. Oh, this would be a perfect mini nuke situation, but I'm not sure. Okay. <laughs> you guys saw nothing. There's nothing there. There's nothing there. I don't even think it killed. Do we break sneak? I keep jumping all over the place because this is insane. This is probably the most tricky situation I've ever found myself in Fallout 4. Um. 
found myself in in Fallout 4. Let's use one more of these stealth boys. Usually like to have five. That's a Primus right there, so uh, he's going to take quite a lot. Oh, boy. Well, he's limping. Could fire another mini nuke and just keep going this way. That could work. Let's try it. They're still tanking them, man. Oh my god, you guys are just monsters. Like, li like literally and figuratively. Alright, let's take out the Primus. Down you go. And maybe we just take them down one by one. Good. So far, so good. We're remaining in sneak and we're getting the bonuses. Don't... Oh! Shh. Be very, very quiet. I honestly cannot believe how many super mutants there are in here, and I'm wondering if a lot of them came in through the door when we went in through the door. Uh, that's the only explanation, right? Like, God! Imagine how many we've killed so far, and still, look, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, at least eight more. Uh, can we see anybody down the hall? No, I think we'll take these guys out one by one. They're also going to have a lot of armor and grenades, so we want to loot those as well. Oh, you'll get a fight, but you won't see the fight coming, so I guess it's not really a fight. Alright, guys. Any more grenades or anything? A lot of them are just hounds. Where'd that one guy go? I know there's still a bunch over here. Okay. Well, explosives box, but we'll get enough grenades just by looting these guys anyways. Let's continue on to our final objective. We've got a little less than four minutes to go in this episode, and looks like it's right through here. What is this? Keypad. And secret bookshelf, as I figured. By the way, the reason we know the key uh, pad code is because we learned it uh, while listening to the audio log in the puzzle chamber, I guess we'll call it. Safe room terminal. Thank you for your visit, Connection Lost. You're using auxiliary power. An additional fee has been charged to your room. Keep track of your state. Don't forget your in-room security holotape when you go. Uh, eject holotape, safe room security tape. Okay. Contact front desk. Something tells me that's not going to work. And view bill. Is there going to be a pornography joke? Nope. Looks like no jokes whatsoever. All right. Let's go back into sneak and let's listen to that safe room holotape was it called safe room holotape safe room holotape safe room holotape um safe room security tape let's play it hey hands where i can see them now where is the key franny put the gun down what exactly do you think you're going to accomplish my job you're going to give me that key, and I'm going to get paid. Hey, the, the world's over. Are you really? Ah! Ah! Uh, yes. Uh, Scream all you hell. want, Arnie. Ah! Everyone's been evacuated. It's just you we and me. We can do this all day, now focus. Arnie. Where is the key? Fine. <laughs> the hell's it matter? It's on the boat. Fringe Cove docks. Combinations 44, 6. 12. Now, was that so hard? So long, Captain. Now, where the hell's the release to this tool? Sorry, Franny. You're stuck with me. So that's Wabosh, and this is Franny, obviously long dead. Franny has a hollow tape next to her, too. Oh! oh my god, you scared the shit out of me, Nick. To Franny. All right, let's play it. Franny, it's me. I I'm at the Grand. In our old suite. 485130. That's the key to the safe room they installed in case of... In case of the bombs. Franny, I need you to come quick. I, I don't know when they'll be coming for me, so... I prep the boat in case we need to make a rapid exit. But I, I, I can't be a part of this. Nuclear war? I won't do it, and I'm not going to let anyone else use my submarine to blow up the damn world. Please, Franny, I need you here. If this is the end, let's spend it together. Alrighty. Uh, before we end this episode, we have an expert safe here. Let's just open that, take it spoils, and get the hell out. Sweet.
Boom, 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 boom. Very nice. Thank you guys for watching this episode. In the next episode, we will obtain those launch codes. We're still trying to find the launch codes, right? We have a lot of quests here. Um, confront Dima, bring down Far Harbor. Where was the... Where was the uh, launch codes um, quest? I, I know it just told me to find that. The way it should be. Report back to Kasumi. Tell Far Harbor about Avery's murder. Confront Dima about Avery's murder. No. Confront Dima about the wind turbine kill switch. Bring down Far Harbor's defenses. No. Uh, Adam quest. No. Uh, Kading quest. No. Far Harbor quest. Far Harbor quest. And... Far Harbor quest. And it's not in the miscellaneous. I could have swore... Oh, he just told us the launch code, I guess. I guess we didn't get an updated quest. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be it. Thank you guys for watching. In the next one, we will move on in the Far Harbor DLC, and I will see you guys there. Bye-bye.